Hello and welcome to episode 176 of the video show. Today we're going to be talking about the three types of videos that you need to make for your business. So when it comes to video, I think there's three types of videos you definitely need to be making when it comes to your business. There's loads of other different types of videos as well that I think you can make that are very useful. But the top three, the ones that are really important, I think are these. The first one is an overview video. It's also known as an explainer video. Basically it explains who you are, what you do, how you can help. Very, very simple. It can live on your website. You can share it on social media. When people are asking what you do, you send them that video. And it's a really short, easy way of just explaining how you can help. Really easy, and that's all it is. The second type of video is a video like this, so a frequently asked questions video, a video that you make regularly, a video where you're giving value, where you're answering questions, where you're sort of, um, you're, not really, you're not selling anything, you're just showcasing that you know what you're talking about. And hopefully the last 175 episodes of the video show have done just that. Let me know below if they have or not. Thirdly, I think you definitely need to be making as a matter of just regularly, every time you bring a new customer on board, is to tell them by the end of it, or a few months after I finish working with you, or a few months into working with you, I want to sit down and record a video testimonial. And this is really just to explain what their problem was, why they came to you, how you fix their problem, and how things are like now. Really simple, but it really gives a story of how you've helped, how you've solved their problem, and how things are doing now. If you're regularly getting video testimonials, if you're building that into the upfront contract when you first start working with people, they're not gonna be afraid that two, three months down the line, you're gonna sit down and record that video testimonial because they're gonna know exactly what's coming. And if you explain it properly, they're not gonna be afraid at all. And I think those are really good videos to use in other sales videos on their own, or just to sort of explain exactly the process that people will go through when they start working with you. In the next three episodes, we're gonna go into these videos in more detail. So the next video is gonna be about the explainer video. Then we're gonna be talking about uh, frequently asked questions videos. Then we're gonna be talking about testimonials. After that, I wanna talk about uh, video blogs as well. And why you could film video blogs, why you should be filming video blogs, but also why you maybe shouldn't consider filming video blogs if that makes sense. But that's four episodes away. So next episode, we're gonna be talking about explainer videos, so make sure you, um, you tune in for that. That's it for this episode of the video show. If there's any other videos that you have made or you make regularly or you swear by making, let me know what they are in the comments below and I'd love to sort of know how you break down that process of making those videos. So that's it for episode 176. I'll see you very soon in episode 177.